In this video, we'll discuss blood pressure lying down. Why would you take it lying down? I'll tell you why some people have to, how to do it correctly, and are the readings different versus sitting up. If you want to see more blood pressure videos like this one, click the subscribe button and the bell icon. Let's get right to the content. Regardless of the correct position to measure your blood pressure, sometimes it has to be done lying down. If you're ill, have a medical condition, injury, or recovering from surgery, you may be confined to a bed at home or in the hospital. Another common reason is to help a physician make a diagnosis of either orthostatic hypotension or hypertension. This occurs when a person's pressure lowers or gets higher when they stand up from sitting or lying down. Another diagnosis a doctor may check for is supine hypertension, which is when your blood pressure is high while lying down. If it's necessary to measure your pressure in a lying down position, many of the same rules apply compared to when sitting down, like five minutes of quiet time, having the cuff at heart level, avoiding coffee exercise and smoking 30 minutes prior to measuring, use the correct cuff size, support your back, yes, even when lying down, keeping your legs uncrossed, and empty your bladder ahead of time. There are four common errors people make with the lying down position. The biggest one is resting their arm directly on the mattress. For most people, this puts the cuff below heart level. The American Heart Association specifically states if the arm is resting on the bed, it will be below heart level. They also say the arm can be supported by a pillow so the cuff can raise up to the same level as the right atrium. Just like when sitting down, if the cuff is below heart level, your reading will be higher. Another mistake is some people will start their five minutes of relaxation prior to lying down. You should lie down first then start your five minutes. I mentioned back support, and this may sound silly to some because while lying down, your back is already supported, but it's important to keep it like that. I've seen people lift their back slightly off the mattress while reaching for their cell phone or TV remote. This will tense your stomach muscles, which may affect your reading. Also, no matter how comfortable this may make you feel, don't cross your legs. So now the question, is blood pressure higher or lower when laying down compared to sitting up? This topic is somewhat controversial. I've researched medical journals, studies, and research papers. I found eight trusted high authority sources, and four of them said it's higher, three of them said it's lower, and one said systolic was higher, but diastolic was lower. Why the inconsistencies? I can't say for sure but the studies didn't mention arm or cuff positioning, which we know affects the readings. So no one disagrees with that. So when I require a solid answer on blood pressure, I always lean on my most reliable sources, the American College of Cardiology and the American Heart Association. They stated systolic has been reported to be 3 to 10 millimeters of mercury higher while lying down and diastolic 1 to 5 higher. You might want to learn more about how arm position affects blood pressure. You could click on my video about that right here. If you found any value in this video, click the thumbs up, and I wish you and your loved ones the very best.